welcome to Infinity's Shaman Circle. I have created a sacred space dedicated to you, your body and soul, and our spirit tribe connections. Here, Soul Family Journeys Together. Hello and welcome to Infinity Shaman Circle. I am Infinity. I'm so glad to have you here. I'm very excited for this podcast. It's not my first one, but it will be the best one because there is direction here from the get-go as to what we're going to do. And I will explain that in a moment. But first, a little bit about me. If you're not familiar with who I am, I am a divine incarnate uh, working with the light. I work with all dimensions and realms um, of the light, including angels, archangels, ascended masters, ancestors, spirit animals, Mother Earth Gaia, the dragons, the fae, the galactics, the myrrh, and uh, the unicorn. With that said, I am guided in my life to dedicate myself to the connection and exploration of ourselves with our souls, our soul missions, our soul stories, uh, deeply connecting with nature, with animals, with plants, with trees. I am a generational shaman. That means that in my ancestry, which is of Colombian descent, um, aside from also European, that um, but focusing on my uh, Colombian descent in this lifetime, that I do come from a line of medicine men and women. Even my own uh, grandfather in Colombia was a parapsychologist. So he evolved from um, the jungles and was a healer in his own right as a parapsychologist. He gave me my first pendulum. He taught me how to astral travel, how to remote view, um, when I was only nine years old, when I went to visit him in Colombia, I wish I would have had more time with him. I wish I would have had more time in Colombia. Um, and I will be going back there again and visiting sometime in the future. But for now, I am connected to Gaia through my home in the San Bernardino Mountains in California, in Southern California. Um, I feel like I live in a fairy tale with my connection to the wildlife um, that is right outside my window and the trees, the big, big trees that surround me. I am so close to Mother Earth Gaia and she and I work together very closely and have for several years on so many different levels. Uh, the way that I connect with her and I channel her and she brings messages. She's taught me so much and I know that truly we have just begun. Um, there's been a lot of evolution for ourselves, those of us who have been awoken, conscious, spir spiritually awakening in our lives um, over the last several years um, or maybe several months or several weeks or several days, whatever your situation may be. But wherever you are, Know that we're at a turning point here as I record this at the end of March, March 30th, 2023. Um, I'm about to finish three straight weeks of daily shows, Monday through Friday, that I've been doing live on Fireside and on YouTube called The Daily Spirit, Infinity Shaman Circle da Daily Spirit, where I'm bringing in information about the current energies, galactically, spiritually, um, energetically, um, from Gaia herself and from her planetary family within our own solar system and beyond. Also reading Oracle messages, which have been so on point. It's unbelievable. Um, with what we've been discussing and then providing and facilitating and channeling astral guided uh, channeled meditations. And they've been quite amazing. All of this leading up to the Soul Quest program that I'm launching on. Uh, well, the first live is on April 3rd on uh, Fireside and simulcasted on YouTube. 
this is a paid program uh, facilitated from my website. I have channeled a map for every one of our bodies and also for our identity and our spirit name. So the bodies are as follows. We have our, we have our spiritual body, the mental body, the emotional body, uh, the physical body, the energetic body, and the abundant body. And then we have our true identity, and then we have our spirit name. So eight maps, eight uh, series of questions and assessments to ask yourself and to respond to, to help bring to the surface everything that you need to know about what's going on with you, where, where you are, what needs to be uh, focused on, prioritized, healed, cleared, uh, what needs to be revered and honored and acknowledged and everything in between on all of those levels to help you connect with your soul. That is first and foremost when it comes to spiritually awakening and really what the name of the game is. While we can be distracted with so much that's out there to learn and experience and consume when it comes to spirituality and metaphysics and um, and all of the mysteries of the occult, uh, and there's plenty and it's all very exciting. If it's not in alignment with bringing you back to you and connecting you with your soul, then it's a distraction. It's something that is going to occupy you, but not fulfill you in the way that it would if you were already soul connected. And maybe you would be paying attention to something else entirely. Sometimes we spiritually awake and we're still so deeply programmed into the matrix and the matrix programming, the material matrix programming, that we still keep a lot of our habits. They just look a little different. Like our uh, um, uh, interests don't change that much. Or they change in a little bit, enough to convince us that we're really um, changing and evolving when we're really just being... Um, circulated through something very similar that keeps us distracted and away from ourselves, which is very, very easy because the truth of the matter is that the more soul connected that we are to ourselves, the more in alignment we are with our bodies, the more powerful we are, the more healthy we are, the more autonomous, the more sovereign, the more, the more strength we have, the more creativity, everything about us, our life, our very life force is supercharged. We're no longer decaying and aging. We're even aging in reverse because we're so aligned with ourselves. We're so in tune with our bodies. We're so clear from toxic, negative, heavy energy that everything is abundant and above and in the higher uh, frequencies. It's a wonderful place to be, and since I spent most of my life as a psychic, physical empath, completely unaware of what I was or what I can do, and even though I knew I was psychic as a very young child receiving messages from, from uh, others, guardian angels to give messages to them, uh, and feel in my body energy on so many different levels that I and nobody around me understood. So I was very, very sick for a very long time um, into my 40s, as a matter of fact, into my 40s. And so uh, once I became came online and was given information in a very, very amazing, magical, spiritual, mind-blowing kind of way over and over again, I... Uh, and I learned about myself. I learned about empaths. I learned about energy. I learned um, how to connect. And I connected with all that was around me my entire life that I was um, in too much static to truly connect to. And so we have me over the last 10 years 
getting stronger and stronger, helping people along the way as well to heal themselves. Like I healed myself through intention and working with uh, divine counterparts, with working in a way that you are powerful, um, tapping into your own strength of intention is is extremely powerful. So I've helped people go from chronically ill um, with very serious situations like I had to go to completely healthy and no longer in those situations anymore. And then sky's the limit from there as far as uh, really what they're doing with their lives because they're no longer wrapped up in so much negative energy. Anyhow. Another thing that I do that go that's very congruent is help people soul connect, get into the nitty gritty of connecting with their soul, being in balance with the divine feminine, divine masculine, focusing on the divine inner child, um, which is a perfect blend of the two. We all have both. And it, the, the name of the game is to have both energies in alignment and in balance within us. Um, a perfect swirl of both. And then our divine inner child, which is truly the essence of our soul, no matter who we are, is to uh, be in a, oh, here's one of my kitties, is to be in alignment with, with our soul and to live our lives through that intention. So we're not confused. We're not stressed. We're not anxious. We're not depressed. We're not tired all the time. We're motivated and inspired and happy and peaceful and creative and co-creating. And all of that comes from being soul connected. So I guided, I was guided to create and facilitate to, and I channeled the Soul Quest program. Again, launching or have launched on uh April 3rd for our live show, the first official podcast for Infinity's or episode for Infinity's uh, Shaman Circle is to be released tomorrow um, on the 31st. And then I'll come back from that point forward, at least weekly on Fridays, uh, publishing by noon. I'm going to discuss that coming week's map. And so whether you're, you take part in the course or not, uh, you can still benefit from this information. But of course, if you were to participate, that would be even better. And I highly suggest that you check out the Soul Quest program and the accompanying uh, Spirit Walk package that you can take uh, along with the soul quest program. So that would be a spirit walk for every single map plus one at the end. So it's nine spirit walks, um, in that package. Now you can start with this live, uh, on the third, or you can start afterwards. And either if we're still in those first nine weeks, you can, uh, be behind us or catch up to us, or you can do it at any time after that. Each way is set up on the website for you to start when you're ready. And what's really exciting is that I was guided to uh, provide a lot of options to pay for this program to make it as easy as possible for everybody with payments up to $100 per month for five months um, or you can pay in full the full five hundred dollars. I'm not adding anything onto that for paying long for taking longer to pay, and it is still paying for something that you finished two months ahead, um, uh, or three actually three months before that because it's only a nine week program. But to make it as easy and as accessible as possible to everybody. I was guided to do that. So please check that out on archangelslove.com. That's where you'll find all the information about me, my programs, my packages, and how I do things, my Evolve Now program, of course, the Spirit Quest program, and um, 
And aside from that, I'd like for you to join me on Fireside. Uh, of course, I'm going to have these weekly programs. I also do programs or shows, live shows on, on uh, Fireside, actually. Live shows for the, each full moon, each new moon, uh, and pop-ups of what I call psychic oracle readings, full spectrum psychic oracle readings that come with, um, that I just open up all of my abilities to. So energy reading, uh, mediumship, medical mediumship, um, it can also be included in that. So if you follow me on Fireside, you'll be notified when I schedule one of those pop-ups and you can join me. And the way that those work is that I'm guided to pick people in the gallery to give readings to. And they are not basic, short, five-minute readings. They are exactly in everything that you need, sometimes over and up to 45 minutes um, or even longer, actually. So check me out there. Also check me out at medium.com. I have a publication called The Messengers, and I write exclusively on The Messengers publication. Uh, as often as I'm guided to uh, over various topics, um, that all encompass spirituality, energy healing, uh, astrology, moon phases, galactic stargates, channelings, and anything and everything in between that has to do with your well-being when it comes to spirituality, uh, your spiritual and energetic and physical uh, well-being and health. Uh, any kind of divine or galactic information that you are meant to know. I'm going to put it either in podcast form, in, in written form, in an article, or I'm going to do a show about it, or maybe all three, depending on the situation. So check out my website, archangelslove.com. Make sure you subscribe so you get on my email list so you're aware of what and when I'm doing things. Um, and I do update uh, as much as I possibly can. Also follow me on Medium and that's medium.com slash at infinity underscore 963. All the links are going to be in the description and you can find all the links also just by going to my website, archangelslove.com. And I want to thank you so much for being here and I hope that you join me uh, become a subscriber and and follow this journey of the Soul Quest program. Listen to all of the maps. I hope it inspires you to join me on the Soul Quest. It's good for everybody at any time of your spiritual development. It's meant to help you connect answer some very, very specific questions like, what does your soul want? And what should you be doing? What are your soul missions? What's your soul purpose? Um, and uh, everything in between that is so important for us to, to know, to help us on our journey. And then, oh yes, besides that, beyond the Soul Quest program, I'm going to be coming to you with all of that kind of goodness is as I'm guided at least once a week, I will have co-hosts sometimes, interviews sometimes, I will be solo sometimes, I'll be answering questions, putting out polls, all sorts of stuff. So, so please be engaged, be as involved as you possibly can. Share this information and this brand new podcast, Infinity's Shaman Circle. And I hope you join me whenever I may do live events, which I love doing lives. It's one of my very, 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 very favorite things to do is live shows and live events, which I will be doing for the podcast. Um, and until next time, welcome and thanks for being here. I'm glad you're guided here. I hope that you stick around and let others know that you found me too. Till next time.